So what type of look are we going for? So, okay, she expects me to give her that like kind of drag queen type of look. No, I'm, it's not a drag queen type of look, but then it's like in your face, but not really. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you get me. <laughs> not like, <laughs> but. <laughs> like, yeah, Hi guys! So welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining us. So as you can see, and you probably already know with the thumbnail, I am joined by a very special guest, Ustasi. Achia, wait a minute. I'm joined here by my younger sister! Ah, I got you! I feel like I look like such trash Just while I'm sitting right here because she's all, you know, beat up on the face Red and I'm not here. Ready. Oh my gosh, babe. Like, I feel like <laughs> <laughs> But she still looks for you guys. So. Oh. Come on. <laughs> like, <she's just> <laughs> Okay, so you guys, she's actually going to be doing my makeup. She's actually a professional artist. Please introduce yourself. Hi, you guys. I'm Ayanda Luisa. I'm a makeup <laughs> artist. I'll actually link her Instagram account on the screen. And I'll also leave her email address so that if you're interested... Oopsie, I'm so sorry. We've already started drinking. If you want to mm. link up with her, I'll also Don't get bored, I see. <laughs> Why couldn't you let that one go? Why didn't you let it go? Wait again, and of course, studio audience, Gaffi Solye, Nakafu Paha, Kiyo Mole in the background, Lanitimos. And speaking of which, because we are already drinking, we're actually drinking Savannah, I'm gonna pour you under drink, and I cannot come long. I am like, it will assist too much. It will assist too much, and I'm gonna be drinking this glass. Oh my gosh, thank you. I've offended last. If you thought I was bougie, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Guys, if you thought I was a bit bougie, oh, brace yourself. Okay, I'm anyway. not. I'm not. Trust me, I'm not. Right, Kathy? No, no, she's not. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, as you see. So guys, let's just get right into it. I'm so excited to have my face then. After here, we're going out for drinks. Like it's messy to have dinner. And you now. guys, I am so excited because I haven't like touched the sunny's face. I've mm. never touched her face before, so <laughs> it's actually my first time. So it's actually like interesting and we'll see what happens. But we'll it's see not how you're true. gonna turn out. But that's no, not true. No, 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 Zandi. Because she actually did like my face. I, I wanted to hire her for let me like, rectify. my big day. Let, let me rectify. Mm. I only like did her face just like I am, I just did her touch ups, that's it. And I've just never done like a full face beat and stuff. But then that has never happened before. Okay, I suppose. And you guys, the reason why I was also doing the sister tag, like my sister does my makeup, is because she's like queen of face beat. I'm more so, I go for like the more everyday look. I'll do that video for you guys as well. But for now, I wanted to give you like an absolutely glamorous type of look by an actual professional makeup artist. Because honestly, guys, I just wing it. Kind of like even with my makeup, you can see I, I just winged it. Even Lily eyeshadow. So with her, she's more creative on that side. And that's why I preferred that she would do my makeup for this particular video. Anyway, let's just get right into it. Okay, guys. So this is what I'll be doing first, tweezing, because her eyebrows have to be nicely tweezed. Because, of course, if you want your eyebrows to turn out just like me, you have to tweeze. So you can't be like, oh, bushy eyebrows, they do your eyebrows. No, it doesn't work that way. <laughs> so you first have to tweeze your eyebrows in order yeah. for your eyebrows to turn out extremely fine. You know that, right? And then do you charge for... No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. No, I don't. So guys, this is a tweezer that I use. You can find it anywhere. And guys, it's not painful, by the way. It's not painful. Ouch. Okay. Let's see that. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna use that type of tweezer in a while. Oh, we got to do the nakafis again when we're done. The fact is, nakafis. So now you're pretending ah uh, away. Oh like, hey, I'm fine with tweezers because he's got like thick eyebrows. 
guys now I'm done tweezing what I do some people prefer starting with the foundation but I prefer starting with like the eyes because I feel like I take time when it comes to eyes that's very interesting because I prefer starting with eyebrows and then foundation but with Ayanda I've observed her she starts with her eyebrows and then she goes to eyeshadows before she applies foundation yeah, that's but yeah, her eye makeup is legit everything, guys. I, I can't do it at all. Unmatched. Unmatched. <laughs> oh my By God. the way, guys, the eyebrows are like literally the important part when it comes to makeup. So if your eyebrows are like crap, <laughs> your whole makeup is going to be crap. <laughs> So this is like literally my favorite part if I just like conceal like your eyebrows. Isn't it exciting? You ladies, you feel me. If you're a makeup chick, you feel me. No, I just want to be done with my makeup. <laughs> so that I can just repeat. But sometimes I do enjoy like putting on my makeup, the whole process. But the most important thing is my face turning out exactly how I want it to turn out in my head. I actually hired Ayana for a very important event that's coming up soon. And I want Angora. No, of course. Ayana makes business a pleasure, by the way. Oh my word. <laughs> of, absolutely, of course I'm going to pay her. Nothing for my other guys. My plug of her land because she was a plane. I can put on land to see. What are you trying to say? No, I'm just saying that. And now I'm no longer. They no, told you so you can't make it because I realized. <laughs> I no, I'm just like, I've never more. seen you go through the process. That's what I'm trying to say. Really, <laughs> tell us all. It's always just finishing touches in the car. I never I've done car. my entire but makeup in the car. But I'm driving at the time. It's not like I'm watching oh. exactly what you're doing. But to be fair, I can say all of this majority of the times. So it's always I see her bare face, and then next thing, full makeup is on. <laughs> 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 so guys, this is like a concealer. As you can see, it's like extremely light, lighter than her skin tone. I like this actually. It gives like an illusion like you tweet or something. I use it right now and I, I use like a shade that's lighter than my actual skin color. So it, I feel like it actually gives the illusion like that it pop out. But okay, I did my eyebrows. So this is like a Lego Pro Concealer. Oh, so you actually put the concealer on your the yeah. palm of your hand. Yeah. Oh, we can do that too. What do you do normally? I just take the concealer right from the tube and start oh, working. No, I just feel like it's way easier. I actually like making it like look flat, you know, flat to not flat, per, flat. <laughs> so I just like use my two fingers. And then it's like super sharp and mm, it's accurate. Like a razor. Yeah. Mm. It's actually like for primer, I don't actually use like the actual primer. I actually use like a fit me spray. I feel like it does the job and it makes your makeup last longer. So that's what I'll be using to brown the face. So what does it do? So do you still use um, the primer when you're done with the foundation? No, or I you just use it underneath or you use it after as well? After as well. Oh, okay. Ooh, then you don't have to buy primer. No, you don't have to primer, yeah. It actually does. Bite. It makes your makeup last long and just like sit. And that is the purpose of a That's primer anyway. That's the purpose anyway. of a primer. So it's basically like the same That's thing. a nice trick. I like that a lot. Yeah. Okay, so really guys, awesome. as you can see, the eyebrows are done, so I'll be literally going to the eyeshadow part. So guys, the eyeshadow palette that I'm using is Colors Limited, 15 color eyeshadow. I literally bought it like Pashino. So, yeah. You and bought it where? Pashino. Oh. So, I'll be basically starting with the warm colors, which is like orange. Yeah, that's beautiful. Yeah, that's the beautiful color. colors. These three are my favorite. Really? That's yeah, nude. Guys, the nude shades are literally my favorite. The first, the first three, three are like so pretty. Yeah. Okay, but anyway, 
Well, Surprise. I'll be literally starting with this one, not the favorite one. <laughs> I mean, it's. Oh, well, she is a makeup artist. <laughs> so, don't you have like a transition color you have to start with? Or is that this is like matter? literally the transition color. You know, it's actually important because you find mm. some of the girls like looking like pink, it doesn't look okay mm. because they actually probably you start with like this color. It's not gonna look nice, it has to look 3D. Mm. Mm. So, what type of look are we going for? So, okay, she expects me to give her that like kind of drag queen type of look. No, I'm, it's not a drag queen type of look, but then it's like in your face, but not really. <laughs> I don't know if you get me. <laughs> okay, so what colors are we going for for the eyeshadow? Okay, so we literally gonna go for nude. The so first three colors I'll Oh, so you start. are gonna use this. Yeah, I'm literally playing around with the colors. Because we're not like, <laughs> but... <laughs> Like, I'm here, see me, like, I'm, I'm wrong, like, I'm boring the thing. Okay, in simple terms, that's what that yeah. is, yeah. So, Ayanda, when did your love for makeup start? Uh, that's actually, like, an interesting question, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so, basically, when I was, like, 18, mm. and I just liked staying at home, just, like, doing my face. Mm. Like I was actually learning about my face and I just like did makeup and I actually tried different type of looks mm. and I actually didn't notice that like that was actually practice for me mm. and I actually as like the days went mm. my makeup became fine oh, By the way as you guys can see this is like yellow Oh yeah, oh, yeah. Yellow. It's yellow Insane, right? Very so insane. yellow and orange are literally the best colors. They go hand in hand. Yeah, mm -hmm. hand in hand. Beautiful. Okay, what are you doing now? Um, so this is like my smolliki eyeshadow. What's yeah. the name of the eyeshadow palette? Oh wow! That's so serious. So Okay, guys. I can tell something was written here. Yeah. Guys, the name is Tuchi, let us. We don't know what this. We. Oh yeah. Oh, guess Scarlet Hill. Yeah, oh yeah. Scarlet, Scarlet Hill, you guys. <laughs> And you were just like, I'm yeah. just like, it's like a small eyeshadow and it has basically has three colors. So, but I, I want to use like chocolate. It's like chocolate, chocolate brown. Ooh. Let me say, let me chocolate. say, it's cocoa, I guess. So, yeah, <laughs> it's cocoa. Yeah. If so I'm basically using cocoa only. The first one. That actually looks nice, wow. Really? From yeah, the orange Yeah, Alicia has the... never seen... Yo, that is okay. Okay, guys, that's the first. No, but from the orange, it, it's like it... It blends in well, oh, surprisingly, right? I can right? Think of orange a bit, but it's not really there. Yeah, really. not really there. Pretty dope. And yeah, actually do something, dope. they play a role. Mm, Even if you can't it does, see it, it, it does, does play a role. See, yeah. I don't like a tease, you guys. Gracias. <laughs> Are we only gonna go for the matte uh, eyeshadows or we'll also do shimmery eyeshadows? Okay, shimmery eyeshadow, okay, it's overrated and I feel like it reminds me of 1960. <laughs> or something. But you do shimmery eyeshadows. Okay, where do you do see shimmery? I only do glitters. Oh, glittery. There's a difference. Glitters. Oof, okay, guys. Because I mean, I want them to see. Okay, so are we gonna do that look? Are you gonna have glitters on my face or not? Or not? Mm. Maybe a little. A little. A little. Yeah. Guys, I love shimmery or like literary eyeshadows. I know Kimo Avanka Kitty Colors are 1960. At that time, guys, I love shimmery eyeshadow. Like, mm -hmm. if you want them to see, just do glitters. <laughs> do glitters instead, no? <laughs> yeah. Okay. But okay. glitters is for like a night look. You basically gonna choose your favorite color, yeah? Okay, 
I'm not gonna choose. I feel like I do that to all my clients. Like, you choose your favorite color when it comes to glitters. Jesus, Ayana's makeup bag is literally wowza. Hmm. What's the name of this? Okay, wait. Makeup? I literally have two. Oh, two. it's glittery shades. What is this? Okay, the Huda Beauty. Wow. You guys, how cute is this? But the mm. other. Yeah, how long did it take you to collect all of them? <laughs> what do you mean? Sheesh. Is it a lot? Yeah, it's it's like, a lot. There's plenty of it. This is like. It's all happening. Which is your preferred uh, palette? Is it this one or that one? Because I can tell they're both glittery palettes. I prefer this one. Which one? This one. This one. This one. Then I'm definitely using this. <laughs> Oh, but I think my favorite, I think I'm, I want to take, I like this one. No, we can I actually mix the glitters. You do? Yeah. Oh, perfect. Then I want a mixture of this and this. What do you think? Oh my word, don't say of that. Of the gold I normally and bronze. Mix this and this. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm, I picked a combination of bronze and gold shimmer, um, not shimmer, gold and uh, bronze glitters. And is it gonna go hand in hand with the orange and the yellow or whatever? Orange and the yellow goes in well with anything. Anything. That's the thing guys, orange goes in, in everything. Trust me, even the green. Can you imagine? Green and orange. Yeah. Metric. No, guys, I'm going Oh, that is really dear. <laughs> and does it already have glue? Can I touch it? It already has glue. You don't need like a, a, a glitter glue. It already has glue. This is literally the final touch for the eyes, which is like the liquid eyeliner. Is it the matte liquid eyeliner? It's or? Matte. Oh, perfect. It's matte. Guys, Whenever you buy eyeliner, I suggest that you always go for the matte eyeliner because you know how certain guys get each hippie, so that's I don't like, know, they shiny. That's it's a cocky or something. Yeah, so <laughs> it looks shiny. So the way, just you look for the matte eyeliner, then it looks way better. And Zandi knows eyeliner is legit my favorite <laughs> when it comes to makeup. Mm. But have you seen the Egyptians, guys? The queens oh my of word, the yeah. These eyeliner. So that is classic. Yeah, that's classic indeed. Who's with me? I'm sure someone out there is with me on that. Please look down Because mm. you know. Close my eyes or look down? Look down. Okay, so that's a trick now. Mm. When I literally go down with the mascara, mm. you look up, slightly up. Okay. Ah, lashes. These are the lashes. Not too long, not too short, just okay. Like, guys, so Ayanda's makeup services, she gives people free eyelashes for every makeup look. She's really brilliant at picking, like, really nice eyelashes. But, guys, no, I don't know. I feel like at this point in my life, I don't know if it's like Fianca like or whatever, but, like, I really don't like those really, like, kind of heavy looking eyelashes anymore. So she bought me more natural looking eyelashes, which I'm very happy about. I'm oh. actually measuring her eyes. You know, some people have wide eyes, some people have small eyes. So of course, it has so to go along with So please guys, cut on the lashes, ne? Because the next thing yeah, they are come on the side. No. No. Like Ayanda doesn't cut her lashes because they're very long Yeah, eyes. I don't cut my lashes. Nah, I, I, I kind of have big eyes, but they're not very long. long. 
so I also cut my lashes. Okay. So you guys just like put on a mascara to actually make your fake lashes and your natural lashes like link together. Okay guys, I am done with the eyes, the eyeshadow and also what's next? The foundation. Okay, so guys, I am using Maybelline Fit Me. It's 324. I'm literally using two foundation colors. 335 and 324. Okay. I'm mixing them. I just can tell you about my skin color. And mm. I mix. Then you know how much to pour the yeah. dark or light one. Mm -hmm. mm. So you're basically creating a color. Yeah. Yeah. It's like really paint. It's almost like paint. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> this is like legit your color. Exact color. It's good. Good. I'm gonna ask you because you're a guy. What do you think about girls who put on makeup? <laughs> your honest, ultimate opinion. Okay. Zandi knows. Before Zandi. Before Zandi. No, yeah, no, actually, no, before Zandi. Yeah, that's no, it's always been, no, true, true. No, it's always been like that. She knows that I prefer, I don't mind the makeup. Okay. But she knows that I prefer the natural look or whatever, you know? First time I met her, she was all beat up. You know the I first mean? time you met me? Oh, second time, actually. The first yeah. time we went out, let me mm. say that. Yeah. yeah. You know? She was all beat to death. Oh. <laughs> Yo, beat to death. <laughs> you know, but I prefer the natural look. You know, it's, it's just a matter of preference. But I don't, I don't, I don't mind makeup or anything like that. You know what I mean? You don't mind makeup. No, I don't. I don't. No. Okay. I'm all about embracing what works for you. Good. If, if you are a makeup person, go for it. If go if, for it. But as long as like not too much. Yeah, no, 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 I'm not. Am I too much right now? Oh, you, you're decent. I've uh, seen you do way more than that. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, actually, yeah. This is like my natural. This is look. Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. yeah so that you're natural look and yeah. Natural. Landy did used to put on like. Boom! <laughs> yeah, because I was a makeup girl, and mm. honestly speaking, I did prefer makeup for the Oscar Bota that I'm wearing makeup. Mm. But I could tell how good Canadian is able to tell that I'm wearing oh. makeup, and that was how I personally wanted it to be. Because I was just like, what's the use of me applying makeup? It would be asking, do you have makeup on or not? Like the the that chick, the lady on the side. You finally make up, Nina. <laughs> So, no, it's not the style. Uh, oh, that type of makeup I applied when so I go to you sleep. You make up me see if I need. See if I need. that type of makeup I applied when I'm going to bed instead or early in the morning before I take a shower. My forehead is a bit darker than the rest of my face. Yeah. But you know what to do, right? What do you do? You apply gangani. No, it means mm. I like a, a contour. A contour, right. Okay, okay. This is probably like, what is I am doing mm. to my body? Mm. I know girl with those guys, by the time you know that they're cheating. <laughs> <laughs> Look up for me. So I love guys, the sweet. beauty blender literally makes it like tone down a bit. And it, it also makes, makes the fine lines from the brush yeah, disappear. disappear. So it's a really nice trick. Okay. Does she still look like a... No, no, she does. That <laughs> looks like a skin tone, actually. Yeah, mm. the, the, the power of the beauty blender. 
But so another I thing that I always tell people, usually, like for instance, I know I have a, my face is a little, maybe like a shade lighter than the rest of my body. And that that is normal. Like people shouldn't be in despair because obviously you use more facial yeah. products, you exfoliate your face more than you do your body. So what do you think? Do you think um, it's very important that you wear foundation always on your neck and your face so that it matches your neck and face? Or you don't have to do that? Because no, it's a waste have, of... No, you have, have to. You have to. Okay, fine. You have to. No, I didn't think you have to. Really? No, you have to. Mm. Because I feel like it just goes in well. It's okay if the rest of the body, but as long as the face and the neck are just like the same color. Right. Okay. Uh, remember the girl that I used to oh. do like the, the, eyebrow. the eyebrows and stuff oh, underneath? Okay. So this is the very same shape that I'm going to use. Oh, like, for I'm, my dark and the eyes. Oh, okay, look up. Ayanda, tell me, what type of uh, foundations do you prefer? Do you prefer cream foundations, um, stick foundations, or liquid foundations? And within those three foundations, do you prefer matte, oily, or is it it's matte, oily, and what? Matte or oily? Yeah, matte or oily. Yeah. So I prefer liquid foundation. Mm -hmm. I feel like it it goes according to your skin. Mm, I mean, right. if you literally have acne, you're suffering like with acne, pimples and stuff. I feel like it's it's better for you to go with the creamy, the creamy part because right. it literally it's full, full coverage. coverage. And then for the liquid, if you have like a smooth skin and all of that, I prefer like the liquid. As you can see, oh, I literally that's have so good. Now it's smooth skin. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so for me, I I literally have a smooth skin. But I literally have like few pimples, but then I just prefer liquid because it's it's easy to it's cover. easy. But then if you suffering with acne and stuff, then I prefer it for you to use like a creamy foundation. Well, and then with the free oily, oil free, oil free no. or matte. If no, your skin, oily or matte. yeah. If you if you you have oily skin, I prefer you to use like matte. matte. Oh. And then if you literally have like. Skin. Dry skin, then use the oil oily, one, the oil oily one. Yeah. Ooh, that's yeah, that's true. Okay, so we're gonna start with the contour. Mm. Do you normally contour your face or what? Never, only my nose. She's gonna use the cocoa. Remember the cocoa I use on my eyelids? The same cocoa I'm gonna contour your face with. It's not complicated, guys. You don't have to dry tons of makeup and products. You can still use the same thing over and over again. Right. Please also mention how contour is very important according to face touch. I would contour my face like so here. And then I'll turn and then it would grow like so. And I'd be like, I look so bad. Kante, <laughs> it's not for my face structure. Oh, yeah, guys. So, for instance, I, I have a round face. Yeah, I hate it. I have a round face. Why? So, no, so I know. I don't like no round. No. So if you want to make your face look more slimmer, you're gonna have to do like a bit down. You see what I'm trying to say? Like lower, lower, lower face. Lower in your lower face, and then if you literally have like Zanny's face structure, well, have a little up um, so that it brings in the cheek. Yeah, higher. Yeah. I didn't know that. I would literally go like so. And I'm like, why the hell do I look like so? And, oh, and guys, even the brushes, the brushes are important. Can you see this brush? It literally has an angle. Your contour brush has to have an angle. Mm. There's a difference. Where's this brush Between from? the MAC. Oh. So as you can see, these, there's a huge difference. Even though they look alike, the one like has an angle and then the one is not. Mm, so it's, it's just a like, contour brush. Yeah. This is the contour brush. The last part it's going to be the nose. I know how you do the nose, you just do it off from here, but I'm gonna start from like the we'll see. Okay. Not 
done with the nose yet, but then we're gonna literally bake her face a bit. Just a bit. Just a bit. For Zandi. What I'm using is actually a transition powder from like Yardley. It's for every skin tone. So if you have to do like a whole little shower, how long does it take you? I'm actually fast, yo. How long does it take you? It has to be like 30 minutes for each, each person. Each. Like I have to be quick, 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 quick. And then Makoti is last. Yeah, the bride is always the last one. Mm. So guys, this is the highlighter, the glow kit that I have. <clears throat> it actually has different shades. Well, for her, I'm gonna actually use the last one. Yeah. Before I actually like put the glow and stuff, right? I had to use the the Fit Me spray. The, mm. It actually enhances the. What's it the called again? The setting spray. The setting spray. I'm yeah. gonna see it, guys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm changing careers, guys. Book me. Krishna. So, do you feel like a makeup is very essential in your life? Yeah, to me it's very essential to my life. I can't live without it. Okay, I can, but then it's part of my life. It's part of me. It's part of your identity. Yeah, yeah it's, it's part of my identity. Right. Like, you can't have Ayanda without no makeup. <laughs> like, just know if you see Ayanda with no makeup, it's either uh, I'm not, I'm just not feeling well. Because I, I put on makeup even when I'm not going anywhere. That's how it makes me feel happy. Because some women have like low self-esteem issues and stuff. So I know I can't change anything about that because uh, confidence comes from within, but then makeup does something because that part when a woman sees herself looking at herself in the mirror and she like she's like transformed, that's like the beautiful part of being the makeup artist because you can see she's happy from within hmm. and that makes me happy. Hmm. That's like the... That, that's the that's <laughs> deep. So what do you feel about people that always diss, you know, girls by like getting their makeup and what Well, I feel like if you diss girls who have makeup, if you're a girl, you're saying that because you don't know how to put makeup on, so you're consoling yourself, you're making yourself feel better mm. for no reason. And if you're a guy, you're saying that because you can't have that type of chick. Mm. So girl, you can, girl, you can literally rock your green lashes, purple, any color. If you feel like literally having makeup on, well, it's for you. Do it for yourself, not for anyone else. The same way if you prefer not having makeup, makeup on. and you just love yourself in your natural form. That's it's also so, okay. That's also amazing. I mean, I Big feel like... to you. Exactly. Like, I feel <laughs> like people should stop coming for people for doing what they want to do. Like, if I'm comfortable with wearing my afro, my bare face, yeah. there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. If I feel like wearing my wigs that come up to my knees, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. If I want to wear my green lashes and a face full of makeup, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. As long as it doesn't affect you in any way. Exactly. Coming for people for doing what they want to do is insane to me. I was actually like walking, mm -hmm. like with my friend, mm -hmm. and this guy was just like, si swing me, gab. So leave me, God. You know, and I can tell I'm just like, actually, I felt sorry for him because he doesn't know me. And why would he say that? He's actually sad, so he's trying to make me miserable because he's also miserable. So I was just like, okay. And now I know the type of person you are, so it's okay. You're trying to bring me down. I can tell that you're already down already. You're a down person. So you're trying to bring me down. Oh, it's because you're not feeling, yeah. You're trying to bring me down, and it's not gonna happen, not on me. Speaking of which, I am this British accent literally is the most insane thing ever. Hello, my name is Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my wow, I killed it. Though. Oh, you actually killed it. Hello, my name is Johnny. Okay, <laughs> okay. Well, hi guys. My name is Ayanda. I'm from London. I'm not from here. Well, I met my sister, Zandi. So shout out to Pervency, shout out to Birmingham, shout out to every one from Britain. Yo, my homies, lasses and lads, all of you down there, I love you, okay? 
Y'all my mates, for real. <laughs> so this is like the your actual powder. Okay. Look up for me. This is the two colors that I'm gonna mix for your part, your, your blush. That color, the second one, and then the orange one, yeah? So guys, comes back to, you don't have to buy the blush. It's all about mixing and using the very same thing. Being creative. Being creative. Absolutely. So one, two, and if you go like that, and then. What is that? It's actually like a, a contour, a contour lipstick. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's for contour, but it's extremely darker for you. I use so it for myself. Using my lips for lipstick. For life. Yeah, you can use it for many things. It's all about creativity. What's the name of the thingy? Revlon New Color Stray Life Proof Matte Foundation Stick. It's for contour. It's, it's very dark. By the way, guys, this is like a Flex Love Liquid Highlighter. What did you use? Because your one looks more gold. It looks like your hair. It looks like my hair. <laughs> I guess it's the hair that makes it pop out, but then... Yeah, I, I mix it. I actually... Uh, this one actually makes it pop out. There's something about it. Yeah, it's it not like the powder out. one. Mm. I, so you I actually have to take a little... You have to be careful when it comes to this one. Extremely careful. It mustn't be too much on the brush. Like a beauty spot somewhere, like yes, yes, yes. I'm a beauty spot. Ooh, your hand has to be still when it comes to the spot. Not just that, I want. Oh, you yeah. okay? But isn't it even tinier than others like you? Okay, guys, I am done with Zandi's face. Uh, <laughs> well, wow. Yeah. Okay, so be the judge, please. My <laughs> <laughs> okay, I haven't seen my final look. Where's the mirror? <laughs> Are you nervous? Da, 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 da. Gakuso wait, is it nice? No, it's gorgeous. Are you sure, sure, sure? I'm the ultimate decider. Whether Gakuso thinks it's actually dropped dead gorgeous. I don't trust Gakuso's face. Really, what do? What? Oh my word! <laughs> oh my gosh, I look so gorgeous. Oh my goodness, I've never done my makeup like this before. Nana, you are so talented. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. You see, this part is like literally my favorite part. We like the gold sees her face. That is <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Everything is so blended. I mean, what? That's insane. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Okay guys, I hope you guys love my final look as much as I do. I am literally going crazy! I love this makeup look. This is absolutely amazing. 
I don't think I could ever do my makeup like this, guys. Now my makeup is literally the most basic, subtle makeup in the world. So I hope you guys appreciated this video. Thank you so much, Nana. Thank for... you for having me, actually. Thank you so much. Really? Guys. Oh, yeah. man. It's an Thank absolute you. pleasure. Once again, I will link in her instagram handle down on the screen i'll also put in her email so that if you want to work together you can contact her she's absolutely very affordable it's worth it she's absolutely amazing super talented i'm very happy with your work uh you want to say bye okay bye you guys <laughs> bye <laughs> why are you being shy all of a sudden <laughs> bye guys